Students are getting ready for a big competition this weekend. Erica Dacos joining us live now with more. Erica, good morning. Good morning, and News 8 really hasn't been out here since uh, before the pandemic, so it's great to be back. Joined with me is Liam Faudre, a Director of Junior Sailing here, and a big championship this weekend, grades 9 through 12, are qualifying for Mid-Atlantic Championship, right? Yeah, absolutely. So we've got two teams, both Fairport and Brighton, will be representing our league down in Virginia. We'll be at sailing at the Christchurch School in Virginia. So it's really exciting that our kids have this opportunity to go down and race against the top teams in the country. So they'll be racing against uh, 16 other teams. And this is all levels. So, I mean, you're seeing here different ages, different levels, all to come out together and do sailing. So what am I actually wearing right now? We're going to go ahead and put it on. I'm going to take my earbuds out, and you're going to walk us through what this is, if you want to hold it. Yeah, sure. So this is a dry suit. So we put the, have the kids wear dry suits when the water temperature is really low and the air temperature. And this morning, it's not that cold, but it's better to be safe than sorry. So, yeah, now she's sliding her arms in. Yep, get the arm in. <laughs> There we go. So the water can actually get into it because of the neoprene at the end um, and around your head. So don't mess your hair up. Hold down. Okay. There you go. Here we go. And then and then pull the hair out. And then we just zip the rest. Yep. Yeah. So then you're going to want to zip the inside zipper first and make sure you get it all the way so the water doesn't leak in. Here, let's get that for you. Oh my gosh, we're running out of time. So I'll send it back to you in the studio, but much more on this coming up. And we're just making sure we do it right, we do it safe. <laughs> All right, Ericetta, thank you very much. Uh, we'll check back in with you later. And 10 different area high schools participate in the sport with the Rochester Yacht Club. Next November, they're hosting a national championship regatta at the club. Good luck to them, yeah. definitely.